is Ariana. I come from collegeadvisor.com. Um, and we're going to tell you guys a little bit about how to stand out in the college admissions process. Um, and we'll talk a little bit about how and what College Advisor um, does to help students in the application process as well. So again, my name is Ariana Pagan. Um, I have my undergrad degree from Emmanuel College in Boston. I also have my master's in educational research and I'm a licensed social worker associate. Um, I've been in higher education for five years, primarily working in admissions and academic advising at uh, universities such as Emmanuel College, Babson College, and Northeastern University. So where on an, in application um, do students have an opportunity to stand out? The first is going to be on your transcript. We want to see that students have taken higher level courses than just the core curriculum. So that includes honors, AP courses. Um, and we want to really see that you can handle that higher level of work because um, that is what's going to be taken at the college level. Um, the next way to stand out would really be to schedule an interview with the admissions office or with an alumni, depending on how the university works. Um, this is a really great opportunity to show us your personality and really create a personal aspect to your application. Because what happens is in that interview, the notes from that interview then get put into your application. So whoever's reading it can see, oh, wow, this is what happened in the interview. You know, this person sounds great, whatever it might be. Um, and the next would be through extracurriculars. It's not necessarily that we want to see everything that you've done, but maybe you took a summer trip to Europe that changed your life. Maybe, um, you know, you created an app for uh, an iPhone or an Android. Um, you know, it doesn't necessarily have to be that extreme, but maybe you found your passion early on and showing us in your extracurricular activities how you've contributed to your community and how you're showcasing that passion um, can help you stand out as an applicant. And the last piece would be the college essay. It's really important to understand that the college essay is really what can tie your essay, your entire application together. It really provides a jumping off point. I know from experience, a lot of admissions officers will start with the college essay just to get a sense of the student. Um, so that's really like your first opportunity to showcase yourself and why you're applying and what you can contribute to the university. So going off of that, what, what makes a great, great essay or a great extracurricular list? Number one is gonna be your cohesiveness. Um, to be honest, you know, admissions advisors, we read a lot of applications in a day, anywhere from you know, 30 to 80, depending on the size of the university. So you have a very small window to make an impression on an admissions officer. And so when we're reading your essay, we wanna see that it flows, that we can get through it and that we can understand your point of view and it doesn't jump around a lot. We also want to see your creativity. Um, we're not looking for anything extreme. We're not looking for tragedy. Um, to date, for example, the best college essay I ever read was about a student's 15-minute walk to CVS. Completely ordinary. We've all done it, but just the way it was laid out, the creativity behind it um, really stands out, you know, five years later for me. Um, and of course, grammar, we, we notice all of those little grammar mistakes. So reading an essay that is not just cohesive, but grammatically correct, um, and we can tell it's been edited is definitely what will help you stand out. Um, you'd be surprised how many students don't reread their essay um, or check for grammar. And for extracurriculars, as I mentioned earlier, what doesn't make, we, we're not looking for everything that you've done in high school. We wanna know what are you passionate about where is your energy being put into that is contributing to your community? Um, and how are you going to bring that to the university? I think that's what's important. Um, and consistency. So we want to see things that you've done for at least two to three years. So how does College Advisor uh, help with this? Um, we take students through the entire application process from uh, helping you create a candidate profile, understanding you know, where uh, your jumping off point is, creating a college list, brainstorming essay topics, um, editing your college list. You know, we also offer interview preparation, um, standardized testing help, financial aid help, um, and really tracking your application progress throughout your entire college experience. Um, and if you're interested in working with a college advisor one-on-one, -on -one, you can go to collegeadvisor.com. Um, and in the bottom right of the screen, there is um, a little uh, 
chat box. And if you just type consultation in there, you'll actually get a live team member to walk you through a consultation, which is free. Um, and College Advisor is great. I myself am an advisor. Um, and there are over 150 of us willing and ready to help you, you know, get through your college application list. Creating an account is free um, at collegeadvisor.com and it's also free to schedule an advising consultation. Um, you'll notice throughout your college application process as a junior or senior that everybody is talking about where they're at in the process. You know, well, I applied here and my friends applied here. A college advisor is going to be a person who can really help you stay on track and feel confident knowing that you're putting your best application forward. <laughs>